here's the the elite legend trainer Abel Sanchez. How's it going, Abel? Very good. Thank Very you. good. Thank you. Thank, thank you for coming on. Um, we have uh, Sergey here, man. Can you give us a little feedback, a little background on him for you the fans? I, I turned him pro about two and a half years ago, and uh, really, when we first got him in the gym, if uh, he'd have been in my gym, he'd have said, "What is he doing in this gym?" He really wasn't that polished, polished. Uh, kid. And uh, who would have thought that two and a half years later he'd be 14 no 14 knockouts? He's a hard worker. I think his biggest asset is that he just so strong mentally. Is he? Is it the mental factor that helps you as a trainer to have him? But we have Sergey right there. But is it the mental factor that helps you as a trainer to work with these guys? Absolutely, because uh, we're going to push them. We're going to work them real hard, and and if they don't give up on themselves, we're going to get out of them what what they have in them. And he's been receptive to everything that we've done, uh, so it's, it's, it's a pleasure with him. Really, I'm going to tell you something that uh, an elite media member told me on, on the show. They said that this might be the last fight that he's at, at the Avalon. They already see him fighting either under like the, the zone banner or any of those big na big cards because they're saying that he's ready. He'll yeah. be 20 and 0. He's ready for like something big on the 154. Does that put pressure as a trainer to you? No. Uh, Tom and I have discussed that uh, several times in the last uh, couple months. Um, we're ready to move to after move. this fight to move him to another level. Um, it doesn't put any pressure on us because all we can do is just prepare him to be the best he can be mm -hmm. uh, I'm sure that there's fighters out there that uh, will test him and now we're gonna find out what, uh, what we have oh, is he like G uh, like triple G or is he different no 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 come they're on. different people man no, tri well first of all triple G is a special talent that don't come along too often uh, this kid's a good fighter uh, he's only got 14 fights so we don't know really what what he's gonna what level he's gonna get to uh, remember triple G had 350 amateur fights so and so that's uh, that's a major difference, guys. Like at the amateur level speaks yeah. a volume. Not, not only that, he was a silver medalist in the Olympics. You know? right. So it's going to be difficult to uh, to match that. But if we can get half to half the, halfway there, I think that this kid will have a great career.